Hey guys, it's Molly. Um, thanks for joining me. Uh, I have some videos to show you. Hey guys, it's Molly here. Um, I don't know if you guys know or uh, if you're on my Instagram or my TTC after tubal reversal group in Facebook, then you know that I took a test this morning and that it has a light line and I would like to show it to you. And then, after I show you, I'm going to test again. Ugh, now it's getting all dark and gross looking, but whatever, huh? Whatever. So here's the one from yesterday. You probably can't see anything on that. I can only see it when I hold it, like in sunlight. Oh, so, I guess I will. Okay. And then here is today's. It's getting dirty now, but there's a line on it that you can see without like adjusting anything but it definitely looks gross and filthy now that brings me to this i just bought this i already opened it and took one out because i didn't want to make a bunch of uh package noise and Sometimes those packages are hard to open. So yeah. Let's test. One and a two and a three and a four and a five. 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 Kind of crazy, but okay. That's going across, and I'm gonna put it down, and I've covered it with the box. So, oh, so confused right now. I don't know. Um, yeah, this test. Until it went like weird and yellow and gross, it looked like a real line, so I don't know. I think if it is a real line, it will show up on the first response. So um, I'm going to come back in five minutes because I don't want to be crazy and just stand here and watch it. So yeah, see you in five minutes. Okay, it is time to look. There's a line, it's really light, but there's a line. Oh my gosh. I didn't think it was real. I didn't think this was real. And then I had people on Instagram trying to talk to me about how old is it? Like, why does that matter? You know, this journey hurts, and I still am like not sure, and I'm freaking out because I'm lightly spotting, and I feel like I'm gonna lose it again, and I need help quickly. So, okay, it's not dark, but I think you'll be able to see it. So, let me show you. I think you can see it. 
it's really light but it's there and I haven't even waited like five whole minutes so I think I'm going to wait a little bit and show you again and I think that's why it's hard for me to get excited and why I'm so scared. Oh my god. I think I'm pregnant. Oh my god. I can't even believe I'm letting myself say that. I'm so afraid to get happy. This is what happens when you've been through a miscarriage. You just can't. You just can't. I'll see you later. Hey guys. Okay, yeah. It's really light, but it's definitely there. Let's see if I can show it to you like this. I can't help myself. I still have my pee here. And I've got these, so... I just wanna... see. I just, like, need to see. Set that down and one of these good these are better ovulation tests than the ones I just ordered that finally made it after like a month and I don't know one and a two and a three that's a good one Okay, I'm legit going to walk away from these for like five minutes or so, and then I will, please God, let me keep this, let me keep it, I can't handle it again, I just can't, knowing, knowing there's something implanting in, inside, I just, I can't handle that again, but. I'll be back. Okay. It's definitely been long enough that if there's anything, I'm gonna see it. There is like an extremely, extremely, extremely light line, but this is, I don't even think you're gonna see it. This is a very, very cheap dollar store test. And then this isn't even done, but it's like, close to, yeah, it doesn't look as good on there. So I need to show you pointing down at it. Here we go. Lighting in here is not great. So there's that one. I really don't know if you're gonna see it. And there's that one. It is actually close to positive. And it's not even done, but it is dark. It is dark. I think I am pregnant. It's just, I just implanted. Like, I just implanted. So, um, I'm, you're just not gonna see much yet. Uh, but like I said, my concerns are that I'm spotting, but it's like the lightest spotting there could ever be. Like, I have to actually look for it. And, you know, my concern with having a miscarriage the last time I got pregnant and a little worried about it, but I think it'll be okay.
do I dare say I'm pregnant? Oh god. Like, immediately get really happy, but also really, really scared when I say that. But I should go. I am gonna test in the morning and I am gonna email um, the fertility office that I've been kind of seeing off and on. See if they will order me a pregnancy and progesterone test. That way I can do something about it if there's something off. So. So today I also went and had a beta drawn. My beta is six point two. That's not good but they're going to repeat it in two days to see if it goes up or if it goes down. So in the meantime, right now I'm pregnant and trying my best to believe in God, God's power. I believe in God. Let's get that straight. I've got this shirt on, Team Jesus. And I'm really hoping that God steps in and lays his hand upon my pregnancy and helps it flourish and be viable and healthy. I'm still waiting on my progesterone. Um, I made sure to request that as well because I am spotting. And so it could just be chemical, but I'm trying to keep hope up for now. So um, I'll get back on here when I get my progesterone and I will let you guys know and then I will let you go. See you later. Hey guys, I just got my progesterone. It's only 5.8. That's down from 
16.7 on 7 DPO, I believe, so just about a week ago, and it's just plummeted, so I'm pretty sure this is a chemical pregnancy, and I just have to wait it out, and I don't know what else to, to do. I, I think it's over, so I'm just going to wait and see. Um, they said they would do repeat blood in two days, so I might still go to that just to be sure, but yeah, I guess wish me luck. <laughs> Good luck to any of you on a TTC journey, and have a great day, and God bless you.